So I made it, I made it, I made it. Maybe you don't go off to be cute. I do look like a little <laughs> Let's get into it. Merry for a year. Thanks for the happy anniversaries, everybody. She mine. Hey y'all, happy Monday. It's the start of a brand new week. It's actually the day after we got back from Branson and yes, I made it, I made it. It's my one year wedding anniversary today. Y'all, I made it, I made it, I made it. Ah! So I'm just vlogging today. Just showing y'all what we end up doing later on today. I'm currently on break for lunch. I came over here to Academy because I was researching golf shoes. If you know, you know, Kobe has been a stickler with golf, okay? That has been his new hobby. So I plan on getting him some golf cleats. I think they're cleats for our anniversary as well as a couple of shirts. I'm not sure. I'm not gonna do too much. If the shirt's expensive, we're gonna go over to TJ Maxx. Cause my job is very central. Like it's in the middle of mostly everything. So I have time to do both as long as I don't lollygag. With that being said, let's head on into the store and get what we need and head out. that I've seen online. I don't know. They don't really look cute in person, but maybe you don't golf to be cute. He does. He golfs to be cute. So, my camera died. Well, it didn't die. My memory card is full. So, like I was saying, I know he golfs to be cute. And I don't really know if he'll like those shoes. If he doesn't, he can exchange them. I don't see any other cute shoes here. Cause he ain't finna wear sketches, y'all. That man is bougie. He is not about to wear sketches. So I think I'm just gonna get those shoes and go on. So since we were rudely interrupted in the store by the full SD card, it's an office depot like right next door to Academy. So we are about to go in and try to get a SD card. I seen that it was one on sale for $13. So fingers crossed it's still there. So yeah, let's go. And just like that, baby, we are back in action. We're back on the camera because, honey, mm -mm. as long as I have a camera, I will film on the camera, okay? Nothing wrong with the iPhone. My quality on my phone is, like, very, very good. But, like I said, I bought these cameras to film with, so that's what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. Also, Office Depot, they have a lot of good deals, y'all. That this SD card that I got, I don't know if y'all peep the original price, but it was like $33 and I got it on sale for $13. Don't sleep on Office Depot, they may have some good things going on for them, yes, ma'am. So it's currently 1 53 going on two o'clock, so I'm just gonna head back to the office and maybe go buy TJ Maxx later on after work after I go to therapy and. I have a wax appointment and all of that maybe i'll stop by there i don't know but for right now we're just gonna go ahead and head back to the office and i will chat with y'all here after work all right y'all so i am off of work i went to therapy and now we are currently sitting outside of target i came over here because one i'm a little bit early for my wax appointment it's like literally down the street so i'm gonna spend 15 minutes in target i have to get more deodorant might grab a card and then may go over to the clothes section and see if they have something for me to wear tonight i don't know that's a stretch but come on let's go <music> Go getting all disheveled. Coming in here grabbing stuff I don't need, but I think this would be good for the present. You know, I put his shoes in here, his shirts, and stuff like that. It's seven dollars. I think we're gonna get it. We're gonna get it. Mm -hmm. 
all right y'all so we made it out of target with time to spare we have five minutes until our appointment so i'm just gonna go over there and go ahead and go in we did not get anything to wear i thought i was gonna be able to skip tj maxx and get him a little collar shirt you know what golfers wear but they still didn't have his size in target so i'm gonna have to go over to tj maxx before going in for the evening really not the evening but for right now so let me go ahead and get in here and go to this appointment and i will chat with y'all afterwards our senior and military discounts all right y'all so we are done with our wax appointment i think i found the key um if you have minimal hair it won't hurt as bad i think that's the key to it because it really didn't hurt that bad but but my waxer she's about to go on maternity leave so i had to get in with her before she left anywho we are currently outside of tj maxx my time is dwindling down very fast and i'm just sitting here talking to y'all i'm gonna take 15 minutes to search what they have in store and just go from there if i don't find anything he'll just get shoes and a car and some golf gear and that's it because i'm not gonna rush it i'm not i'm not gonna sit here and just make myself buy something the shoes were enough okay let's just say that all right um we're gonna go in here real quick see what they have and then go home and get ready for dinner so i'll meet y'all inside <music> All right guys, so we just made it home. Fixed everything up. I did not show y'all because I had to do it outside in the car, but this is how it's looking. These are his gifts. You can go ahead. That's not yours, that's mine. Some socks, some tees, more polos. Then you didn't even open the car. I love you too. That's it, that's all you got for that. <laughs> oh. Do you like them? Huh? Do you like them? Yeah, they're nice. No, nah, you hesitated too long. <laughs> <laughs> you don't they're like nice. them. I was trying to get like, you know, golf cleats because she's talking about, I need some shoes with a golf ring. If you don't like them, I'll take them back and get my money back. You don't like them. I do like them. No, you don't. Yes, I do. <laughs> I can tell by your face. I knew you weren't going to like them. They look like old men shoes. Huh? They do look like old men <laughs> So now that we're home, I gave Kobe his gift. Now we are trying to find something to wear. I really don't know what I want to wear, what I'm going to wear. I don't know. I need to get on Pinterest real quick. I'll be back. So time is dwindling down and we have to start on our makeup for the night. Not going to do too much, but we'll still look cute. Let's get into it. So my original concept was to chat with y'all while I was getting ready, but because Kobe was getting dressed as well, I didn't feel like stopping and repeating myself when being interrupted. With that being said, I just wanted to publicly thank God and those who have supported me in my marriage thus far. This past year has been a whirlwind, but I am so glad that we saw it through. I have always heard that the first year is the toughest because you are literally merging your life together with someone else's. But to be quite honest, I didn't think it would be this hard. We've been together for so long and I thought it was gonna be a breeze but boy was i wrong about half of the year we were in the trenches thinking we weren't gonna make it i have packed and unpacked my bag so many times this year it's not even funny but every time i set my mind to leave something made me stay i've said it once before and i will say it again marriage is hard you constantly have to find a middle ground in every situation this year has taught me so much about accountability selflessness and unconditional love in the beginning i was more focused on what i thought our marriage should be rather than living in my reality and actually crafting my marriage to be that way fun fact you have to put in the work you won't wake up one morning and everything is peaches and cream you both have to be willing to make sacrifices for each other even when you don't want to you both have to learn how to forgive and not hold grudges <laughs> fun fact <laughs> the fun fact this was and still is so hard for me. One thing about me, I can hold a grudge, okay? Basically, you have to love your partner as Christ loves us. God doesn't hold anything against us once we repent for our sins. God doesn't judge us for our mistakes. We are nowhere near perfect. And I believe once I adapted that approach into my marriage, things started turning out for the better. Now, I'm not going to keep talking y'all's heads off about this topic. I honestly just want to pop in and say thank you guys so much. I love y'all and the community we are building with that being said let's cheers to one year of marriage and i'm praying for many many more now let's get back into the video
so I just ordered this gummy professional edge control. Everybody has been talking about it on TikTok. Yes, TikTok has gotten me again. For real, how you open this? I'm not one to do my edges, if y'all haven't noticed. <laughs> if the edge control is gonna have me sleep down, laid to the side all day, like the girls are claiming on TikTok, I'm gonna get it. I need to open this thing. While Kobe was opening it, I went ahead and put my clothes on so we could keep this thing moving. But like I was saying, I ordered this gummies professional wax because the girls on TikTok claim that it's been holding their edges down. I just want to see. I just want to try it out. Baby, my edges be rolled up, rolled up like the police. Did y'all mama ever say that? Yeah, rolled up like the police. And I don't really do my edges, so I don't really know how to swoop and style and stuff. Now my sisters, baby. It might be doing something, y'all. It might be doing something. This lock fell off, y'all. Oh. I was so sad. It fell off some months ago. Like when I did my first retie by myself. I really need to be putting my shoes on so we can go. But we really making good time. It ain't like I caused us to be late or anything like that. And I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I have been loving Stormy Canvas Beauty's uh, body butter. Body glaze is what she calls it. See, I'm not only wear it special occasions. I don't wear it too often. But my scent from heaven, I wear that every day. That's my everyday scent. But see, I'm a, it just gives that little pop, that little... A little special. I'm gonna put that on, making sure I smell good, I look good. Your girl made it to one year. All my friends that text me, it was like, girl, you made it. I know, thank y'all for y'all prayers. It hasn't been easy, it hasn't, but I thank the Lord for my marriage. I thank the Lord for my husband, who he is, who he was, and who he's becoming as a man. It's a struggle, it's a struggle though. It is tough, it is hard. Married, but all right y'all so i'm dressed i am dressed let me put y'all down so y'all can see me oh let me get my purse but this is how we looking very wifey very one year very much I made it. Let's get ready to go eat because I am hungry. I have not ate all day. Oh my gosh. Ooh, I don't appreciate the chase. Now there's nothing here for me. I gotta go, I fly away to one new space. You know, I don't appreciate the chase. Just like that, we have made it home. It is currently 9.45, so our anniversary is dwindling down. Um, unfortunately, it is a work night. It is a week night, so I can't stay up too much longer with y'all. I hope you all enjoyed just running around with me today, trying to find little miscellaneous things for Kobe. What I asked for was a pair of shoes. So, when that comes in, I will let y'all know. I will let y'all see my new gym shoes. But for right now, I'm about to take this makeup off, take a shower, and get ready for the work day tomorrow. Also, before we close out, the edges, honey? The edges? Yeah. I didn't even wrap them. I didn't even tie them down. Okay, gummy. 
Let me find out. Let me find out the TikTok girls went live, okay? Like I said, we're going to wind it down and end this little video. I hope you all enjoy spending the evening with me, spending the evening with us, and just taking along with us, celebrating our one-year wedding anniversary and all the good stuff. I hope you all enjoyed the little chat that we had, getting ready, and all the things, all the things. Also, thanks for the happy anniversaries, everybody. Good night or good morning, or whatever. I shall see y'all in my next video. Bye. Sorry, I had to interrupt before we closed out. For real, for real. We forgot to eat our cake. I saved the top half of our wedding cake for our one year, and we forgot to eat it last night, so that's what we're gonna do. It's 10 o'clock in the morning, but hey, we gonna eat it. You excited? Mm-hmm. Anywho, this is our cake. I can unwrap it now? Yeah. Good with a little bit of freezer burnt. She lying. No, I'm not. I'm taking not good. The icing is still good. It's just freezer burnt. All right, y'all. So that is for real the end of this video. Hope y'all enjoyed. Have a great rest of y'all week.